Hello folks, I'm Johnny McCobb, your friendly neighborhood psychopath, the creep of the class, here with another indie horror let's play. This one's called Fear of Clowns. Uh, it's a new one, just came out I think a couple of days ago. I picked it up on Steam for like two bucks. Uh, looks interesting. Looks a little bit reminiscent of uh, Emily Wants to Play, another game that's been out for a little bit longer that I'm going to be, uh, I'll cover on this channel at some point. Um, in case you can't tell, it has clowns in it. Uh, let's take a look. I love how the how the cursor is a uh, clown's little red nose. Oh, that's right. I don't have a save. Uh, there we go. There. Uh, let's see. This game contains scenes which may be too intense for children and people with heart diseases. Bet you they started making this game as like um, cash in on the the clown news business that was going on a few months back last year. I think it was was it last year or was it earlier this year? I don't know. That was crazy though. All the clown sightings. One thirty-seven. Someone just rang my door. Hey. hey. Hello? Hello? Oh, I can't look out the people. Oh, well, I'm in a, like an apartment building? Huh. That's interesting. See if I can break into my neighbor's place. Hey, Bob, you up? Hey, Bob! <laughs> the hell? Where was this game made? I love how this is an entire building. I thought there was, this was just going to be in like a single house. But this is like a whole apartment complex. That's kind of cool. Makes me feel like it's going to be a lot larger and more involved than I initially thought. <clears throat> well, Mr. Clout? Mr. Clout? Yeah, this has to be like a Russian game or something, because that is not Arabic lettering. <clears throat> not sure if there was supposed to be like some backstory there or what. But I guess I'm not going to get the backstory. Oh, open elevator shaft. That's always good. Hello? Let's see. Let's orient myself with the light. Um, hmm. Is that another piece of paper there? Oh, those are keys. Let's take those. Those are going to be important, I'm sure. Someone lost this keys. Yeah, uh, English is not your first language, apparently. Mixing a singular with a plural. You don't English too good. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, there's broken. Well, I have keys. Will this let me break into my neighbor's apartment? I'm just gonna go down the hall, just trying them at every single door. What was that? What was that? It was tiny! What was that? I didn't get a good look at it. it. Scared the shit out of me though. Was it this tricycle? Was that all it was? Fuck you, tricycle. That was good. That was a good little jump scare there. Hello? M Mr. Clown? Mr. Clown? Oh. Let's open that person's apartment. Hi, guys. Just, you know, look around your place. I went to the abandoned hospital last week. Yay! Let's see here. There was a strong fire. Huh. I found the strange toy. <clears throat> That's what I think I saw walk. I thought I saw like something. It's like a little person. I bet you it was that little asshole. There is no internet connection. Ah, no! <laughs> In Soviet Russia... I got no. Hmm. Oh. Yeah. That's where he was. Oh, is this made by the same guys who made Craft here? Mm -hmm. Oh, hello? Hello, I couldn't reach you. Recall me. Sure. The number is not available at the moment. Please try again later. No. Yeah, Cry of Fear is another indie horror game. I actually have it on my Steam. And I'm going to guess if they're plugging it right there, they're probably the ones behind that one, too. Tommy Knocker, Supernatural. Huh. But the door was locked. The little toy, get out. Don't I have like a flashlight or something? Huh. Well, it's just playing around in the dark. The little killer toy running around and bite my ankles. Bah! We do not drink beer in Russia! Only vodka! Asshole neighbor downstairs is the reason that we got killer clowns running around the place, huh? 
had to bring home the creepy toy from the freaking amusement park or uh, hot hospital, whatever it was. Sorry, I think clowns, I think amusement park. Why is this one empty? Why is that one blank? That one had a sign on it. Please open. No. Okay, so what am I supposed to do? Something attack me! Come on! Come at me, bro. I just like to do that to my neighbor's doors at night. It keeps them on their toes. Lulling me into complacency. I know your tricks. Hmm. Oh, this one opened. Saving. Loading. The clowns really want their toy back. <clears throat> Come on. Bad luck. Hello? Oh, pills. Bullets? For those bullets? Huh. <clears throat> I was sure that this nightmare never returned to me. When I was a child, I saw frightening things which other people cannot see. My parents sent me to a psychiatric hospital. Doctors gave me a lot of medic. Medicament, <laughs> and I pretended that I feel better and don't see my visions. After a few weeks, they would let me go home. But one of a new play, uh, one of a one of a new patients brought this strange toy. Terrible events started to happen from this day. Uh, my Russian accent is horrible. I'm just gonna stop now. I'm sorry. You didn't deserve that. Oh, hey. Oh. Uh huh. Oh, Mr. Clown! Mr. Clown! Can, can, you, can you do balloon animals, Mr. Clown? Well, that door doesn't just, like, stick out at all. Huh. I wonder what's in that one. <clears throat> Why is this door nicer than mine? I'm going to talk to my landlord about this. Alright, well, let's see here. Oh, hmm. Interesting. Hey, free TV. Ah, uh, that's unusual. Especially since I don't. I think it's plugged in. God. So many channels and nothing to watch. <clears throat> hmm. 
Okay, so I'm supposed to go in here again, I guess. Where are you going to take me now? Where are we going? We can't go see the clowns? Is that where we're going? Oh! Uh-oh! Just die? <laughs> nope. Oh. You're a you're a large clown. Okay, that's the little that's what I saw running by. I didn't think it was a freaking tricycle. It was like a tiny person. God. Look at those teeth. Talk about an overbite, Jesus. Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh. Um. Oh. Okay, well, yeah, let's save. Huh. That's interesting. Sure, let's go out there. Let's go play with the clowns. <clears throat> Can't spell slaughter without laughter. I'm liking this game. Good job, Russia. Or wherever it's from. Apparently I spoke too soon. Okay, let's try this one more time here. Luckily, I mean, it crashed literally right after I saved the game, so it's not like I lost anything. But if it continues to be a problem, I mean, um, maybe I'll just wait for an update. Like I said, this game just came out. Right after I complimented you, Russia. Come on. Jeez. Okay, I think it's going to work this time. I don't think it's going to crash. Come on. Here we go. Almost there. You can do it. You're almost there. You're so close. Believe in you. Okay. I have some sort of. Is that my health? There's some sort of bar on the left there. Huh. Oh, did they take me back to the ab abandoned hospital? Is that where I am? I wish that's where I am. I wish I had a freaking flashlight. <laughs> it's that light I keep seeing over there. <laughs> Let me see here. Oh, exit sign. Ooh, can I take this? Yes! I woke up of the strange noise tonight. Oh, Jesus. My Russian accent is way off. I heard footsteps somewhere nearby in the hallway. I was very scared and I could not sleep until the morning. Ah. 
usually do a much better, much better. Uh, ooh, pills. No, you can't take the pills. Why have them there? It's not fair. I'm so glad I finally have a flashlight. Hmm. Okay. And this is this is me sprinting. This is walking. This is running. <laughs> Not a fast fellow, am I? Oh, I don't think these balloons were here a second ago. And it's a jack in the box. Of course, it's a jack in the box. Okay. Well, might as well get it over with. Oh, gee, I wonder what's going to happen. You got me. Oh. I am a musician. Maybe I can make the clowns my friend, lulling them with my beautiful music. But I can't open any doors. hallway now that I have a flashlight. Hello! Are your oxen free? I don't know if this door was open. Doesn't seem to make any difference. Nothing in here. Use a pill? Use a pills. Yes, I will use a pills. Oh, good. Yeah. I'm glad I did that. That was a great decision. Woo! Yeah! Tripping balls! Need a key to open this door. There's a note. Three patient committed suicide over the last month, but I know that doll killed them. I saw that it conceals within itself something evil. Evil. Circled right back around, I guess. Yeah, I did. Okay. Okay, yeah, I see. Hmm. 
I'm all turned around. Oh my god! Hi! Um. If I. Come say hi, you gonna. You gonna stab me with that knife? Yep, 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 Oh yeah! Yes you are! You go away! Stop it! Stop it! Stop poking me with your knife! Stop it! Stop that! No! Oh, god, I cannot run! Stop it! Stop that! Hey! Hey! Stop it! So, yeah, I can't run worth a damn, okay? Ah. <laughs> uh. Huh. That clown is much faster than I am. <laughs> What's going on? Why am I tripping in here now? I don't get it. Seems to be a pretty well designed game. I can tell it's, you know, still got a little bit of patching to do. You know, what was it? Crashing and... <laughs> like that. Um... Yeah. So, I'm going to put this game on pause a little bit. Uh, I'm going to wait for them to uh, do a little bug fixing. Definitely looks promising, though, right? Um... And I could definitely... Yeah, I mean, if you're scared of clowns, this game could probably give you some issues. <laughs> yeah, it really looks good, though. Um, so I'll give it I'll give it, you know, a couple weeks, maybe see what happens with it, come back to it. Um, so for today's shout-out uh, movie, we have uh, one called Flowers. Now, this one is interesting. It's a It's very artsy. It's a more artistic art house type of horror. Um, it, the story is it's about uh, five girls. They wake up um, in the crawl space. Uh, five dead girls wake up in the crawl space of the home belonging to the guy who killed them. And they're just coming, to, exploring the home and coming to terms with what's happened to them. Uh, there's no dialogue in the entire movie. There's sound effects. There's, you know, a great uh, soundtrack, uh, you know, music score, but no dialogue whatsoever. Um, and the the main focus on this, I would say, is the set pieces and the just the special effects. There's some amazingly well-designed uh, practical special effects here. Definitely want to check this out if you're a fan of like art house horror or gore, extreme underground horror, that type of thing. Um, the guy who made it, his name is uh, Phil Stevens. Um, he also put out a movie recently called Lung Two, which was a uh, which was a really good one. Um, I'd say that this one uh, is a little bit better than Lung Two. This is probably his best work so far. Uh, and I, I, it's one of my favorite movies of all time. It's just really, really, if you can find beauty in like the macabre, this is definitely a movie for you. Um, yeah, so we're going to call that good on this. Anyway, I'm Johnny Macabre, your friendly neighborhood psychopath, uh, creep with the class. Once again, uh, this is my gaming channel. Stay tuned for more.